Hi guys, I'm Harla and this is Popcorn and in today's video I'm going to be going to my first ever show with Popcorn. I've done a few bits and bobs when I was younger but not very much. I just did a few lead reins and I, all I had to do was sit on a pony and look cute. But now I actually know how to ride properly and I've got my own pony. I can finally do more of like competitive shows so yeah I am very excited um, so yeah my saddle's all cleaned and if you watched my preparing for my show video you would have seen we got popcorn already for last night well last night and he's got these beautiful little bunches in he's all plaited up ready to go so I'll probably get his travel boots on his fleece on and then we'll get going. So, right, popcorn. Let's get this all moved. I can trust you to stay there, popcorn, without being mischievous, can't I? Hopefully. Everything is now loaded. So all we need to do now is get popcorn ready and then we'll head off to the show. And I'll see you guys there. So guys, we're just on the way. We're running a little bit late, but that doesn't matter because we've pretty popcorn's pretty much all ready. We just need to put his tack on and then we're good to go. But yeah, I think we're about 15 minutes away, so that's good. By the way, it is also a very sunny day today. I think it's going to be absolutely amazing. It's also quite hot as well. I was saying to my mum, is it going to be too hot? But, you know, and also the countryside is absolutely beautiful. I keep on seeing loads of fields and I'm like, is this it, is this it? But no, it's not it. Also, a couple of my friends are going to be there. One of my friends is from school and the other I'm I've just known for quite a long time. I'm hoping we're gonna park next to them, but I'm not sure what time we're all getting there. But anyways, I'm looking forward to seeing them and their ponies because I've met one of my friend's ponies, but I haven't met my other friend's ponies. And they have never met Popcorn. And I wonder what Popcorn's gonna think of the other ponies because they're all different colors. And I think they're all different breeds as well. So this is going to be very fun. Popcorn is either going to be very, very excited or very, very chilled. So it's either one or the other. Let's hope he's a chilled pony. But when he gets in the ring, he, know, he knows what to do. Because it's my first show, I have no idea what Popcorn's going to be like. So I guess we'll just have to wait and see. Because how many miles now? Nine minutes. Nine minutes, guys. Nine minutes. I see. That's the sat now. Anyways, I'll see you guys when we get there. We're here, Popcorn. We're here. Yes. When we go, and we're very late. Hopefully they let us in. So guys, that was an absolute mad rush. We had to put a different brow band on Popcorn and it was put on the wrong way. So my mum was like rushing to change this brow band. And I was just standing there like, Mum, you're nearly ready. The stew is coming over. We need to get in the ring fast. We didn't have time to film any of the preparation, but later in this vlog, you will see a little bit. But it was just go, 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 go. Like, put the tack on, get me dressed. Put my helmet on, go in the ring, go, 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 go. It was an absolute mad rush. I'm looking back now thinking, why didn't we just like check the brow band before we left? Because we were actually really early getting to the stables. The steward like 
if you don't know what that is, it's basically the judge person. I didn't know what a steward was until today because my mum just told me. But yeah, the person came over to us and said, are you coming in? Are you ready for the class? You're, you're on the list. I, I, think, I think you need to hurry up because the class has started. And we're just like, we know. We were like, we're coming, we're coming. And we were just chucking tack on popcorn, tightening their girth. Mum gave me a leg up. I, I literally trotted. I nearly cantered over to the ring. I was like, go on, hold on, we need to go. We got in the ring, we hadn't even done a single bit of warm up, apart from that little extremely fast trot that we trotted over to the ring. But that was barely even a warm up. So we've entered the ring and because Popcorn is a very, very speedy walker, he got a little bit too close to the pony's bum in front. So I had to kept I had to keep on doing loads of big circles around. By the time I did loads of circles, he just like zoomed up. He, my, he's just so speedy. He doesn't look it, but when you're on him, he's very speedy. So the judge has asked us all to trot round in the ring and she just has a little look around us. And then I was pulled in to do my individual show. So here I picked up Canter where I shouldn't have done and Popcorn has also gone on the wrong leg. That was my fault for not putting my outside leg behind the girth. I shouldn't have picked up Canter at X. Why did I even do that? That's not even a part of the show. So I'm changing the rain now and I should be picking up Canter at the far right corner but I'm not. I didn't even Canter in that corner which was tragic. As soon as I got past the corner I was like Oh damn it, I forgot to pick up cancer. I completely forgot everything. My brain just crumbled down to the floor and I completely forgot my show. It was an absolute disaster. <laughs> so I'm basically just trotting around the ring, cantering whatever I fancy. God knows what letter I'm changing the rain at. Um, I'm just doing my own thing. So after everyone has done their individual shows, the judge will ask us all to walk back around the arena. Then she will pull us in for our placing. And I think we actually did quite well in that. We came third. So we actually came pretty well for the disastrous show that I did. So it was actually quite a big class as well. There are around 20 ponies. But yeah, I'm not counting. There might be less, there might be more, but there were actually quite a lot of ponies. And after we got over it, it was time to do a lap of honour. And I must say, Popcorn's tail was up in the air and he decided to literally charge around the ring. There was a little tiny pony in front of me and I was like, Popcorn, please may you slow down. We're not galloping around the arena for the Grand National, okay? Guys, I got third. Popcorn, do you want to wear it? Yes. That was amazing. For mine and Popcorn's first show ever, we placed third. And I am really, really proud of me and Popcorn. We, I think we picked up the wrong can to lead once, but I'm really pleased. Popcorn was an amazing boy because he didn't even get a chance to do a warm up. <laughs> he had to rush and they just go straight into the ring. No warm up. Popcorn was amazing. So now I'm just walking the course of my next class, which is my working hunter. And I was trying very, very hard to memorize it because it is my first ever course and I did not want to stuff up. So you start over there, go around to that one. Go around that one, that one, that one. Mind that one, back around this one and then that one. And De definitely know it. Yes. Next class is the working hunter and um, it's quite a small course so I'm probably going to do it in trot because otherwise Popcorn will be bolting around and I won't really be able to turn around the tight turns so it's a very tight course so I'm definitely doing it in trot. 
So I'm just entering the ring now because it's time to start our working hunter class. Popcorn hasn't seen any of these jumps before. So this, I, I was thinking to myself, Harlow, if Popcorn spooks at something, try to stay on. I was thinking to myself, Popcorn, do not spook or refuse because these droppers have no grip on them at all and I do not want to get them dirty or ripped either. So fingers crossed. And uh, guys, I know I said we are going to trot the course, but here we are cantering and we nearly ran into the fence. And then, oh, tight turn, tight turn. Oh, we were gonna trot that, but instead we, we started cantering. So the next jump is number four and I didn't turn popcorn quick enough so we very very sadly missed it. So we had to circle number four and jump it again because we missed it and it, the jump was actually, it wasn't because popcorn spooked it or dodged it or anything, it was because we didn't, well I didn't turn quick enough. And now I'm looking for my next jump and I hope I can remember which one it was. Oh, perfect, I actually remembered something then. I should have actually turned straight after that jump because we are heading for some very scary carrots. So I've had to do a big circle once again in the exact same place. I think it's that corner, you know. But anyways, we had to do a big circle again to get a nice line up because if we didn't get a nice line up, I don't think Popcorn would have jumped the very scary carrots that are poking out of the ground wasn't sure he was gonna jump them. So now we're heading for number eight. It's just the same jump, but we're jumping it from a different direction. So that is it. We went kind of clear. I did, we didn't touch any of the jumps, but we missed two. I don't know if that's clear or not, but I'm, 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 I'm counting it as clear. But I am so happy. My first ever course complete checked off the checklist that I have somewhere in my brain but you know all done no refusals I didn't fall off popcorn was amazing I know popcorn loved it because he was a speedy Gonzali I cannot like I was like popcorn we've got to trot otherwise we are going to miss all of the jumps but yeah it was amazing apart from those two little mistakes He was amazing. He jumped straight over the carrots. I thought he was going to refuse them because, well, they've got massive, long, green, sticky, plastic things poking out of them. And I thought you were going to be scared of them, but you weren't. Were you? You're a brave boy. So I've just found my friend, Phoebe. Popcorn, do not kick. Okay, let's go. <laughs> no kicking, Hattie. And no kicking you too, Popcorn. Does Hattie squeal or nay? Have you ever heard Popcorn squeal? I can't remember. I think Popcorn squeals. He, he does it all the time. And he also yawns when I'm speaking. A lot. My favourite class has been probably the Working Hunter. Um, you know where um, best pony rider thing? What is it called? Best rider. You know where best rider is? Where is it? I'm not sure, but it's not yet. Never gets this excited. Really? Yeah, never. Popcorn always gets excited when we're like on hacks. Popcorn has been such a good boy. He has got poo all down his legs though. And I think 
think he I think he feels quite nice being plaited up so because all his mane's off his neck. Don't you? You enjoying that grass? Look, your hair's right here, Papa. Just pouring him some water because he might be a little bit thirsty. Well, he probably is because he's done so well. Why don't you want your nice hay? Yes. Oh. I think he prefers the grass and there's nice hay that's been steamed. Right, popcorn. It's ice cream time. Hello. Have you seen it's been painting? Think about Palomino. Yeah. What's your pony called? Popcorn. Popcorn? Mm -hmm. Oh, Lucy, she's just been watching you all day. What a beautiful pony. Thank you. Okay, before you eat the whole shop, <laughs> um, please may I have a <laughs> a mint chalk baby chip, please. In a cone or a tub? Um, a tub, please. And do you do Mr. Whippies? Um, I've got vanilla in a cone, it's quite close to a Mr. Or... Mummy, is he a that? Okay, we'll have that please yeah. as well. Does it smell nice in there, popcorn? Mm -hmm. It's very interesting, isn't it? Have you done well today? Yeah. Yeah? This first one's not for you, okay, popcorn? It's <laughs> for me. It's very tempting, though, isn't I'm it? very sorry for that you can hear that. Mm -hmm. And I know you're licking your lips. There you go. Thank <laughs> you. <laughs> no, this is mine. Look at <laughs> You can't eat this one, popcorn. Is this one for you? This one, um, that, the vanilla one's going to be for popcorn. Oh, wow. Do you like ice Yeah, he loves this stuff. <laughs> Mum, do you want to hold that? Yeah. There you go. Got it. Okay, let's take the tissue off so you don't end up eating do tissue. You need to take it off. Is that nice? Should we cut away? <laughs> do you want the cone? Yeah. She's all over social media. Oh, right, here we go, okay. Okay. <laughs> there we go. Oh. Do you Was that nice? <laughs> You're faster at eating ice cream than my brother. So now I'm in my next class, which is Best Rider, and fingers crossed that I don't actually stuff this one up and pick up Canter and God knows what letter. So I'm just starting my individual show, and let's hope I get this one right. Nope, I haven't got it right. I've turned left instead of right. Great start, Harlow. <laughs> So now I'm feeling a little bit confused because I've turned the wrong direction and I don't know where I'm going next. Okay, I'm going to change the rain and trot across the diagonal. Oh, that was barely a change the rain, but you know. <laughs> so I'm picking up Canter in the right corner on the right leg. So this is looking a tiny, weeny bit promising. So I'm trotting across the diagonal. Instead, I don't go into trot at all. And now I'm on the wrong leg because I've changed direction. So I'm basically just cantering around the ring on the wrong leg because I didn't bring him back to trot. And now I'm changing the rain for a third time. I should only be changing the rain twice. What am I actually doing? This is embarrassing. People are watching. And part of this show was to do a small jump and Popcorn actually jumped it quite well, actually. I give Popcorn the credit for that and I actually jumped it quite well. Oh, what am I doing? What am I doing? What? Oh my God. I also saluted too early. I should have waited for Popcorn to come to a complete stand before I saluted. Now the judge is making us all walk around 
to choose the winners and it is not going to be me. And I did get placed, which is absolutely amazing. I am so, so pleased. And now it's time for Popcorn's favorite part, the lap of honor. <laughs> you could just see him galloping around. So I got a third place and I am so, so happy about, and it was actually my second third of the day. Now the showing classes are all done and I'm going to try my first little show jumping proper course. So this is actually my first proper course that has over four jumps. This was quite a big step up for me. My memory is not the best either, so it's going to be a miracle if I remember this course. This is the one special thing that I love about Popcorn, apart from himself, is his flying changes. I love him for his flying changes. If you keep an eye out, you'll see that he does it quite a bit throughout the show jumping. Our Popcorn has seen those jumps and he's got his speedy legs on, his ears are forward and he's raring to go. Honestly, he has the time of his life when he's jumping. He absolutely loves it. He doesn't care how sharp the turn is, how big the jump is, he will jump it. Popcorn is being so amazing though, I can definitely tell he's enjoying it because he is bolting around the arena. So it has started to go wrong, guys. I've missed that turning. What a surprise. I am meant to be aiming for the blue jump, but I have missed it. So I'm having to do a really large circle around that jump now, so I'm gonna give it another go. It's such a shame that I missed that blue jump. I can't believe I missed it. But as you can see, it didn't take Popcorn to gather up his speed again. You can see, just see him go into that jump. He's like, whoa. Popcorn is literally looking around like, where the hell are we going, Harlow? I, I hope you remember this. But he is such a good boy. If I'm not sure on the jump, he's not sure. If I'm sure, he's sure. He's basically another version of me. Because we both got blonde hair, we both kind of think the same, you know? He tried so, so hard and his performance was flawless. I think if we didn't make that little wrong turn then we would have definitely come first that was the most lovely day ever i really really had a great experience for my first ever show and i really hope you guys enjoyed like seeing what it's like at a show as well because before i had i'd never been to a show popcorn had been to a couple before we got him but you know and i th I think Popcorn absolutely loved the clear round show jumping because he was bolting around the arena. I couldn't sit his canter. I think it was, I think it was more of a gallop, wasn't it? Yeah. We went clear for that. I think that was Popcorn's favourite part of the day. It was a very long day. There was a lot of waiting around, but Popcorn enjoyed it and so did I, and that's what matters. And so, we actually have some rosettes. I've got one third here. Popcorn, do not eat the rosette. So we got third and another third. So we got third twice, and then we got a special award so that was very good popcorn loved it didn't you yes you did look at all of the nice shiny rosettes that you've won yeah you won those i think you're more interested in the grass at the minute i think we better load you up before you eat the whole piece of land so so guys today there's no other word for it but amazing. Me and Popcorn definitely loved the day together. Cause yeah. And I love seeing my friends. Popcorn got to meet with my friend Pony. And they they weren't a little bit too sure on each other. They did a little thing where they like hoofed each other. But no one got hurt. Everyone is fine, aren't they? Yes, you are. Yeah. And I saw everything basically. I got to feel the experience of being at a show 
And oh my gosh, guys, I can't believe how many of you recognise me and popcorn. Even the judge recognised me. That was just amazing. It was lovely to meet everyone who did come over and say hi. I love meeting your ponies, well, some of the ones I got to see. And I really, really, I'm just grateful for all of you that are subscribed and everything. But anyways, we need to get home, don't we, Popcorn? Because first of all, if you, I eat you, if I let you eat this grass anymore, you're going to get a little bit on the fat side. So I'm sorry, Popcorn, but we're not eating any more grass today. And popcorn's pooing. Okay, that was a lot. Right guys, I will see you next time. Your cooch pony. Let's tie you up. Popcorn. Today we are at a show, the second show that me and Popcorn have been to and he's nicely plaited up and everything and I must say he is looking amazing. He's all in navy and he looks amazing in navy as well. So right Popcorn, should we get you unloaded? Okay Popcorn, you're going to need to move your neck. Okay, right. Okay, popcorn. There we go. Oh, and he sees the grass. <laughs> oh, look at his nice cl clean rug. Because he's a Palomino, he's got all of his Palomino bright orange hairs on. His nice dark navy rug. So that's definitely not standing out. <laughs> So now I need to get all my show gear on, tack popcorn up. I've basically got loads to do. Also do my hair in little braids. I'll polish popcorn's hooves. Oh, also my friend Phoebe is going to be coming today. She is meant to be, arrive meant to be arriving any minute now. So we're just waiting for her to arrive. And yes, mum, what time is our first class? At half twelve. What time is it now? Okay, so we need to get a pot of one tagged up. I'll... No, get, I need you to get ready first. Okay. I think we should do your hair first. Do your hair. No, get a pot one tagged up first, because then he's already. No, because it's not fair. I think let's do your hair. Okay, we'll do my hair. We just had a debate on what to do first. <laughs> right, popcorn's all chill there. He's eating his hay. Right, let's get the hair stuff. Right, popcorn. Let's see, because it is actually quite muggy. It's like not cold, but not hot. So you're actually getting quite hot under there, aren't you, popcorn? So I just quickly whip this off you. Hang on. So I'm going to spray this naff razzle dazzle on him and rub it in with my mitt. So. It's basically like shining spray for horses. Do your leggies. And the front of your chest. And we need to get your bum looking really shiny, Popcorn. Okie dokie, Popcorn. So I'm probably going to do the same thing as last time. Um, black on the front and then clear on the back because that's like kind of what popcorn's hooves look like, so yes. And the, sh the grass is actually quite short, so it's going to be quite easy. Because at the last show, the grass was so long, we could barely see popcorn's hooves. Two seconds. Just in here, Ellie. Okay, I'll pop out. Wait, let me get out so we also have the wonderful Phoebe here, who is featured in a couple of our other videos. Hey, popcorn. Okay. So I've also brung along the fly spray. Oh, you're gonna reverse it to popcorn. <laughs> oh, no. she, you've, 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 
Phoebe's just got here, so they're trying to reverse the space there, and they nearly reversed into popcorn. Hattie's got her pony rug on today. Her donut pony rug on? Yeah. I. Is it? Yeah. Okay, that's good. Okay, right. So we need to. There we go. Right, I'm going to paint his front hooves black, so, yeah. I've already got it all over me. Oh, no. My fingers, though. Oh, good. I think Hattie's weeing. Um, I won't. Steady popcorn. Popcorn. And I've got it on me. Oh no, where? Oh, you. I think she's just had a wee because I heard it. She had a wee before we left. Patty's got her very special um, head collar on. You'll see it in a minute. It's really glamorous. Mm. Ow! Oh. Corn, you just, you just made Harley so And I've got it on him. And the fur? Yeah. Good job we got Ellie here. You know what we could. Shall I, get, shall I get it really wet? You know what we could do? Use that paste thing to make it look like he's got a white sock. Mum, did you bring the paste? The white paste? It's alright, we're getting there. Carlo, do you want to come and see Hattie's new glamorous head collar? I've tied um, popcorn and Hattie quite like tight yeah, really so they can't do any business. Popcorn, you've got hay all in your water. It's become the soaked water. What place do you want to be? What, what place do you want to be? First. <laughs> that's you can, wants to come first. You can also come first. So the hair is all done, looking very nice. Thank you very much, Mummy. And now it's time for me to get changed. So, oh, Mum. Oh clear yeah. Yay. Yeah, so is Hattie. We did have a little bit of an episode with the front hooves where I got it all over Popcorn's fur, but we have managed to get it all off, so that's all good. Oh, it's fine. There. It's okay. Oh, and there's lots of chalk here. Look how much chalk there is. Mum, Mum, you're washing this. I need a wet wipe. Right. Popcorn's just gonna chill there for a sec whilst I go get changed. Yeah, popcorn. You're going to be good today. We're all ready now. We thought we were late, so it was a bit of a mad rush. Well, it always is, but yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, I think we're on our round is on next. Next. I don't even know what class I'm doing. I'm going to go ask Phoebe. What class is next? The class that's next is the novice ridden walk and trot and the novice ridden walk trot canter. And you're in the walk trot canter and I'm in the walk and trot. Okay. Movie groovy. <laughs> now that I've mentioned it, I think popcorn's been a little bit movie groovy. <laughs> Movie and movie groovy. Yeah, popcorn's movie groovy. Same as Hattie. The word of the day. Word of the day. Movie groovy. Okay, 
I think our class is next. Yeah, your class is next and then it's mine. Okay, what are we doing for the walk the trot canter? So you do your show and okay. you start you walk away, then you trot round halfway and then you canter and then do the rest and then when you come through the middle and change the rain you have to trot. <laughs> On now, though, because I think the judges have to just like get ready. But do you want to practice? Um, because I need to yeah. practice. So, do you want to be the judge first? Okay, and then I'll should we do it in this little Ooh. square area here? Right, Holly, you got to come out now. So I've entered the ring now for my first class of the day. We're just walking around a little bit and the judge asked us all to start trotting round. I've got popcorn in a beautiful outline so he is looking amazing. I was just trying really really hard to make him look good at all times even when the judge wasn't looking. The ground was also really hard and dusty, which was not great for his white socks or his mane or his tail. So I'm just keeping an eye on the judge just to see if she's asking us to do anything. So now we're all walking around and the judge is going to put us in on the provisional placings. Let's see how Popcorn did. We have been pulled in first place so far, but don't forget we have still got to do our individual show. And you all know by now I do not do very well at those. Popcorn, I must say I give him all the credit because he is standing a square and he is in an outline. So now it's time for my individual show, so let's see how this goes. I turn right, which is a great start. So now I do not really know what I'm doing. I'm just trotting around the ring, looking cute. Popcorn's just doing his own thing, so am I. No structure whatsoever. What I find difficult when I'm doing my show is where I'm going to do my show and like the layout. It's quite confusing, there's no markers. I don't quite know which direction I'm going at. So I'm just going wherever I want. And the show my mum has taught me back at home has just gone straight out the window. My mum is outside the ring looking at me thinking, Harlow, what are you doing? This is not what we've practiced. And we have been placed at first. I have no idea how we did it. I can't believe it. This is our first ever first. So yeah, I am so proud of us right now. You can win first. I did actually forget to count you on run one race. And my mum would say, carry the run, And I was like, what is it with you doing? But you can come in first, look popcorn. Look. You're so shiny. Okay, I am very happy. And I think popcorn is as well, look! Okay, right, shall we go pop this in this part? Well thank done, you. Darling. First, I did forget to canter on one rain, but we still came first. Do you know we popcorn? Just having a quick quick stop for a nice cream. So now it's our next class of the day and it is part bread Welsh so we're going to see how this goes and hopefully I don't stuff it up like the last several that I've done. As you all know 
Popcorn is a part bred Welsh and a very well done to us both. We have managed to come second place. Lots and lots of pads for popcorn. We're on to another class now. Please don't look at my reins. They look like a washing lines. But we are picking up the right leg in canter, so this is going great. And we managed to get another second place. Rightio, Popcorn, let's put this rosette in because you earned it. You were absolutely amazing. I think we'd be good at it in hand. Okay, Popcorn. Well done. Yeah. Oh, that's a noisy pony. Look at the mum belt. Yeah. Let me get the collection on that. Do you know your rosette wall? Do you know your rosette door? There we go. That will be filled up. Belt. Where do you store your rosettes? I store them on my door, on my door, on my rosette hanger. Oh, hatchie! You, you can get some attention as well. Do you want attention? Yeah, was that it? Yes. I store my rosettes on my bedroom headboard. <laughs> it's like rattan, rattan. It's got hook space for it's it. It's got hooks on it basically, and I hook them on there. Shall I lead you back to the trailer and you're like this? Yeah. Okay. okay. Zero control. So we're just practicing for Phoebe's lead rein and. How does it feel up there, Phoebe? Funny that mm. I'm not making everything move. Make sure she doesn't run you over. <laughs> That's like a bird. And walk. I'm out of breath. Flap like a bird. <laughs> oh! There's brains back. Thank you. Um, could you, um, <laughs> help me? Oh, yeah. So, we are all done. We're just untacking. And it was just really good. That This is our second show, and it was an amazing, another an amazing experience. We've just finished all of our classes. We're just untacking the ponies. I think Popcorn wants a drink. Oh, no. <laughs> His bridle fell in the water a little bit but that's okay popcorn do you want me to undo that for you because i know he's not going anywhere he probably thinks he's tied up anyways <laughs> i got three seconds and one first and that's actually really good so yeah especially for our second show it's amazing. We've also qualified for the sh Sunshine Tour at Hickstead. And I think, are we also taking the ponies there? Yeah. Yeah, we're taking the ponies there as well. And I think... Are we jumping? Mm. I should hope so, because... No, it's a pony, there's not a show. Yeah. <laughs> but we're not going to do the massive, humongous jumps. Because me and Popcorn... Yeah, we're not that high level. So where would you like me to put this? Oh, just oh, on yeah. one of those hooks would be great. Shall I just quickly spray Hattie down with the fly spray? Thank and popcorn yes, and give them a little top up. And so it's a fly potato. What's it called? I forgot popcorn was not untied. Oh no! <laughs> he could wander everywhere. Because I, I untied him because he was drinking and the lead rope was a little bit too tight. <laughs> Teddy Hattie. Good girl, Hattie. Good girlie. Oh, yeah, girl. Look at Hattie's tail now. It's got all white speckles on it. <laughs> Good girly, rub, Hattie. Rub, rub, rub. Rub, rub, rub. 
I want to smell it. I want to know. What does it smell like? Wait, spray it. Spray it on my hand. Mm, it smells right. It smells really nice. Oh yeah, rub it in. It smells nice. I can't. I don't. Rub it on your bum bum. <laughs> bum, 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 bum drum. Give a little bit more on your bum bum. The there we go. <laughs> yeah. He also loves being scratched here. Happy loves that. Like on their sh like shoulder, or pelvis. Shoulder, neck. Pelvis. Shoulder, neck. shoulder, neck, pelvis thing. <laughs> pelvis? <laughs> I don't know. Pelvis is not up there. <laughs> Where is their pelvis? Their pelvis is <laughs> here. Here. Now, where's that on them? Probably here. Here. Yeah, dee dee dee. It's an <laughs> arm's <laughs> length. This can't be up here. <laughs> <laughs> no. Popcorns loves being scratched there. Oh, my shoulder, not pelvis. <laughs> Hattie's got a little braid in there. Yeah. Her hair goes really nice and gingery after it's been brushed. Yeah. And I love a little forelock. Popcorn is like all the way down here. I have seen loads of people go to Hickstead and... I've never ever seen Hickstead before. Is it good? It's, it's amazing. My hands are so mucky. It's... Mucky-wucky. I think I've got some baby wipes in here. Just if you can find them, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I've got no clue where they are. Okay. Patty, which one would you like? She's wearing pink. She's so she is a strawberry rum and these are strawberry flavoured, so it kind of makes sense. Strawberry. Don't, she don't. tried to gobble your shirt. <laughs> <laughs> oh, those nice. She does oh. that when something is nice. She mm. nods. These are yeah? is it nice? Yes, she's nodding. It's nice, isn't it? Okay. Now, Popcorn, you get the yellow one because it kind of matches you as well. Well, hat's got all um, hay on it. Hay on it. You gonna help us clean Popcorn? Or are you just gonna... You can, sn you can <sighs> blow it all off. <laughs> <laughs> it's because you can smell the thing that you put on your hand earlier. So now we're just gonna sponge Hattie off a little bit because she's a little bit sweaty. She goes a really, really nice dark colour when she's wet. Phoebe, do you want to help? Because this is kind of your pony. Yep. <laughs> just, just popcorn bum. Move him that way. Because he can still reach his hay there. Oh. <laughs> Come on. So we're gonna get him ready to go home now. Does Hattie wear travel boots? She hates really? Yeah. What does she do? Oh. Oh no, the bum crashed. The bum. Okay, Hattie, if you just wanna move a little that way and pop one that way, that'll be perfecto. So. So guys, I had a great day, did you? I did. Hattie, did you? Hattie's half asleep, sir. So. Half asleep. Yes. And Popcorn says yes. <laughs> so yeah, we've all had an amazing day today. Especially it was a really good experience for our second show. But yeah, you were very good, weren't you, Popcorn? And should we um, see if the ponies want some water? Because they have worked yeah. very hard. Do you want to take one and then I'll take the other? Oh, there's a kissy. kissy. Have some water. I'll get you wet for you. <laughs> okay, I don't think he wants any. But let's see if Hattie wants some. 
Oh, we've also changed our outfit. We're in our comfies. Feel her neck. You can feel the water jilting down. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah, you can feel it going down. That's so cool. Science with Harlow. <laughs> yeah. You've got hay all on you from where popcorn's got loads of hay in there. So, guys, I thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye. Okay, should we get these ponies all loaded up then? Yep. Do you want to untie Hattie? I feel so comfy now that I'm in my comfies. I've got pockets as well. <laughs> Bye, guys.